What do you call open innovation? Well, the answer is I certainly recognize the concept of open innovation. Uh, I guess when you sit inside a company, it's the valuable exchange of knowledge from outside the company into the company and from inside the company outside of the company. I, I guess we probably think of it about it more often as a company in terms of outside to in, but it does, it does work both ways, undoubtedly. Um, and just to give you an example, if we spend, say, two-thirds of a billion a year as a company on research and development, that's spent roughly half outside the company and half inside the company. Um, <clears throat> and so the stuff that's on the outside is sometimes um, protected, if you like, so it's contract research or that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. But more often than not, the much the larger part of that is um, open programs. So we have uh, created institutes like the BP Institute in Cambridge, the Energy Biosciences Institute on the west coast of the US and Illinois. Um, these are large institutes, they're funded by BP, um, and the research is owned by the university and the PIs, and they can publish it. Um, and, and we think that's a very important part of our innovation ecosystem because we can't always expect these people to have the best ideas in the world, but we probably can expect them to know where the best ideas are.